Welcome to a new video tutorial of PenPod, the open source uh, design and prototype tool for the whole team. So today we are talking about color, how to manage library colors in PenPod. So here we have a file which is a shared library as you can see here and I have uh, saved, already saved, a few colors that I am using in my design. So you go to your assets, uh, you have here the color section and as you could see I already have uh, black, coffee, grey, uh, 10 and 20 and white with all the hexadecimals. Uh, of course I already introduced these names so let's see later but now uh, I'm going to show you how to apply the color. So for example if I select uh, one shape uh, you could do in in several ways. For example, uh, clicking here, you are applying the color you are ha you have selected. Okay, uh, using my my library, you could go here and select my file library, which are the same colors like I have uh, in my left sidebar, and I could apply it uh, in the same way. And if I need the sidebars for other stuff like, you know, a prototype or whatever, I have my color palette here, which I could select my file library, which I could see all the uh, colors that I already using. And by clicking, I apply it in the same way. So, but how I can uh, save a new color. So uh, it's easy, I select the color, I'm going uh, for example for a blue uh, and in my file library I have the plus button clicking here and as you see you are going to to have this input activated to introduce the name for example light blue okay and you are going to get the name you introduce and the hexadecimal as you could see, it's already applied to my color palette and to my color picker. I could use gradients and save it, uh, I save the, the, the gradients styles to my color palette. So for example, if I click here and I use linear gradient, I have, uh, I can modify it in the same, in the way that I, that I want. For example, I'm going to select this gradient for example uh, and I'm going to save it clicking here linear gradient I'm going to say for example I don't know glow as you could see I could storage the the gradients as colors and I could share them with my my library uh, to to my teammates or with with other files and that's all